What's up guys, this is Ferdinand here. Um, this is a little download that um, I'm going to give to you guys. It's um, A lot of you have asked for like rigged models um, and I've put a lot of models out that probably aren't rigged. Um, some of them are, but what I'm just going to um, give to you here is um, just basically like a, like a skeleton, um, which is sort of an easy rig. Instead of making it by hand, I'm going to give you this one. This is the endorphin one. Um, just as it's T-Pose, there's no other animation. Um, but I've used this because it's got, it's set up pretty well. It's got the, the spine, it's got the clavicles, it's got the arms, forearm, hand, wrists, um, forearm twists. And it looks just nice as it is and very professional, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, so um, if you want to just put a model to it, this is what you'll have to do. If you want to rig it, so I say. Yeah, this is all you have to do. So I'll just get a model in. So I'll choose camera off. Because I know the textures are working on that. Um, as you see, you've got your model. You just want to center him. Which, that should be alright. Grab the skeleton. And because it's a base pose, you can adjust the size of it. So I would get the arms in proportion with his arms. Um, and then from then on, that will give you like the correct weight the waist in that. So I'll just put it there, make sure it's still sort of in the middle so his arms are right. And then just basically do like you would in a normal endorphin tutorial where you would go into this and do all this again. I'll just do that. Maybe whack in the knees, bend the knees a bit. Maybe bring, because there's no animations, you can edit all this out now. Um, and you can sort of put that there, sort of just fit him correctly, shall I say, um, maybe just bring the knee into the centre a bit more, that looks a bit better, and then we'll go just onto the arms, leaving the clavicles where they are, just go straight to the shoulder, bring that down, Not right. bring that there, and bring the elbow, and then possibly bring the wrist down to about there and then if needed just bring this down like that and then the same with the other arm shoulder first du -du 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 -du. um yeah um if you um guys want to see any sort of special tutorials like in depth of like any any like detailed um, tutorials about something you want to see like you know just send me a message because I'll get it all done because um, those are the tutorials I want to put out I want to put ones out that actually help people and not just like you know are no use to anybody or they've been over like done or been done so many times like basic text in Cinema 4D you know I'm not going to put a tutorial out like that it's been done so many times so yeah we got the thing now, pretty easy, you've already got your skeleton, then you just sort of adjust him, no need to make it, put your skeleton in, uh, select the children on the skeleton, hold control, select the model, character, command, bind, and then you can go on to do your weight effects and that, um, but as you can see, the shoulder, he's now rigged, but you'll sort of this out, and that is just an easy rig, sort of, I'll put the download for this bones um, in the description, so you can easily do that for yourselves. And I'll keep it at this one actually. I won't do the normal one because this is what it usually is. Um, so yeah, and then you, what you can do is scale it down. But most models are about this size I would have thought. But if not, you can just resize it. So um, yeah, I'll just save this as a Cinema 4D file. So um, put in a comment or whatever, PM me, whatever choice you want to see. Because I'll just do them, you know. Even if they take a few parts, if it helps, I'll do it. Because um, that's sort of. I don't want to put useless shows, like I said. So, yeah, um, um, I don't know whether the guy's following my channel, but that person that I'm meant to be doing the edit for now, um, if. I'm, I'm not being harsh, but. Because there are a lot of people waiting, if I don't get like the clips and that in two days. Um, I'll be starting someone else's because I've had a lot of like people come and see me and if you know 
you're gonna just like sort of not waste my time but if you're gonna take a bit of time I might as well get started on someone else's so I don't want to sound like a dick or anything but I think it's only fair um, that I try and get as many people done as I can so um, yeah if anybody what I'll do is perfect opportunity um, if you want your video edited um, comment on this video um, and just put in block capitals um, edit mine or something like that and I'll just put all of your channels in a list and I'll just randomly pick one um, and then I'll do the edit for you so um, depending on how many you comment you know if you don't get a lot if I don't get a lot of comments on a video you might have a bit of luck <laughs> if you shove your name down so yeah um, do that and I'll do my best to get everyone's queries and that sorted out so peace